As night descends on Night City amidst its ceaseless hum, a new vigil emerges beneath the intermittent patter of rain. I am vengeance. I am the night. I am Batman. These words resonate, not just as a mantra, but as your newfound reality. Feel the city's pulse, its urgent cry for justice, and step forward as its guardian. This journey is more than navigating Cyberpunk 2077. It's about redefining your presence within it. With batarangs that catch the neon reflections and fists that carry the weight of promises to a city veiled in darkness, you claim the high ground, not only as a tactical advantage, but as a moral statement. You're not the hero Night City deserves, but the one it needs. Every shadow you blend into, every challenge you face, calls you to honor the legacy. Your decisions forge a new legend under the bat signal, a beacon the city has yet to see but desperately needs. Embark on a crusade unlike any other, where your battle against the shadows and corruption becomes the pulse of Night City's chaotic heart. In this journey, you don the mantle of Batman's solemn vow, rising as the beacon of hope this city desperately needs. Welcome back to the channel, folks. Today, we delve into an extraordinary exploration, the quest to embody the Dark Knight in Night City, challenging the boundaries of what's possible within this cybernetic metropolis. A note of intrigue before we ascend into the night. Our adventure stretches beyond the confines of ordinary gameplay. The arsenal at our disposal, including the iconic grappling hook and specialized gear, transcends the offerings of the vanilla game. Armed with a collection of mods, we resurrect Batman in a realm that never anticipated his shadow would grace its streets. Our mission transcends crafting a mere guide for optimal gameplay. Instead, we delve into the essence of embodying the Dark Knight himself, exploring the joy and depth of immersion that comes with donning the mantle of Gotham's most iconic guardian. Prepare for a captivating adventure through Night City's neon-lit streets, a place where the pursuit of justice intertwines with the marvels of cybernetic advancements in ways beyond your wildest dreams. We're about to embark on a shadowy voyage to discover the true significance of being Batman in a city that's desperately seeking its savior. As the final echoes of Gotham's darkest hour faded, the world stood witness to what seemed like the end of an era. The Nightfall Protocol, far from a defeat, marked a deliberate pivot, a chrysalis from which Bruce Wayne would emerge transformed. Beneath the cloak of night, he slipped away, his legacy interwoven with the mythos he had meticulously built. Wayne Manor lay in ruins, a tangible sign of the Bat's departure, leaving Gotham to mourn the loss of its nocturnal guardian, believed to have vanished into the annals of history. Yet, in the realm of shadows, there is no true demise, only an evolution of being. Bruce Wayne found himself drawn to Night City, a sprawling urban expanse mirroring Gotham's chaos, yet distinct in its anarchic vibrancy. Within this neon-laced labyrinth, tales of the Batman circulated like phantoms, echoes of a legend from a realm now seemingly distant. The fire that once fueled the Dark Knight's crusade, that beacon which pierced Gotham's gloom, remained undimmed. Night City, with its corruption and decay, cried out for a savior. In the quiet that followed nightfall, a new guise of vigilance was born, sculpted by the essence of this new domain. Here, Batman was reborn, not as Gotham's billionaire protector, but as a phantom, his essence fused with the city's blurred lines between flesh and circuitry. He became a wraith navigating the pandemonium, his arsenal a fusion of era-defining tech and the unyielding spirit that had always been his hallmark. Amongst the digital dissonance and chrome-clad streets, Batman found kinship with rebels like Johnny Silverhand and Panem Palmer, spirits resonant with his own defiance. They recognized in him not merely an ally, but the embodiment of their shared resistance against encroaching darkness. Together they delved into Night City's underbelly, their alliance a beacon to the ceaseless quest for justice that Batman epitomized. This epic heralded a renaissance, not solely for Bruce Wayne, but for the very symbol Batman represented, a beacon amidst the encroaching shadow of a dystopian future, asserting that ideals of justice, courage, and perseverance endure. Night City, for all its cybernetic augments and dystopic despair, unknowingly yearned for the Batman. 
beneath the neon glow and amidst the digital haze, a new myth was forged, transcending the bat to embody a broader crusade. From Gotham's ashes rose not an end, but a proclamation of resurgence. This reawakening of Batman was more than a promise to a city. It was an oath to an era teetering on the brink of the unknown. With the heart of the Dark Knight beating within, he stood ready to confront the future, for the essence of Batman is timeless, and his vigil, eternal. As cold rain cascades down the neon-lit streets of Night City, it finds an ally in Batman, who, like the rain, serves as a purifier amidst the chaos. Rain. I've always liked the rain, he reflects, its relentless patter a familiar comfort in his endless night watch. The rain, impartial and unforgiving, cleanses the streets, a natural counterpart to Batman's own crusade against the city's darkness. Amidst this nocturnal symphony, the glow of neon on wet asphalt mirrors the technological advancements now woven into the very fabric of his mission. His utility belt, a storied relic from Gotham, has been reborn in the crucible of Night City's technological renaissance. Advanced smoke pellets, grappling hooks and batarangs lie ready, each piece reimagined with cutting-edge enhancements that blur the line between the man and the myth. The Tron identity disc, a luminous marvel, spins through the night, its trajectory as loyal and precise as any batter rang, yet it glows with the promise of tomorrow, a beacon in the relentless dark. But it's not just the tools that have evolved. Batman himself has adapted to the rhythm of Night City. His combat style, once a testament to physical prowess, is now augmented by the Gorilla Arms cyberware, a nod to the city's brutal necessity for strength and restraint. These arms, though capable of devastating force, are wielded with a precision that speaks to Batman's core principle, to incapacitate, never to kill. So you won't kill, but you're fine with traumatic brain injuries. Secure the loading docks. In his hands, they are instruments of justice, calibrated for the delicate task of navigating Night City's complex web of digital, cyber-enhanced, and physical threats. In the solitude of the rain, Batman contemplates his place within this neon-drenched labyrinth. The rain washes away the grime, the sins of the city, but the shadows remain, he muses. It's in these shadows that he operates, a spectral figure moving between the realms of myth and reality. Our Batman, this dark knight of Night City, embodies the delicate balance between the past he honors and the future he shapes. With each drop of rain that falls, he's reminded of his purpose. A silent guardian, a watchful protector, cleansing the streets not with water, but with unwavering resolve and the hope for dawn after the darkest of nights. As night descends on Night City, the iconic silhouette of Batman merges with the shadows. This city needs a new kind of guardian, he whispers to himself, clutching the reinvented batarangs in his grip. These aren't just weapons, they're extensions of his will, glowing with a neon fierceness that mirrors the city's heart. With a flick of his wrist, they sail through the darkness, targeting not to wound but to disarm, their silent return a testament to the precision that defines him. The air fills with the hiss of smoke grenades, now more than simple cover. They're an art form, each burst crafts a maze of confusion for those who dare challenge the night, while Batman moves unseen, a phantom in the fog. Invisibility is strategy, he muses, vanishing into the urban expanse with the grace of a specter. His approach is revolutionized by a drone-enhanced grappling hook, turning the cityscape into his playground. The higher ground is not just physical, Batman reflects, swinging through the neon-lit canyons, a blur to those below. This city's verticality becomes his domain, each leap and bound a statement of intent. Yet when subtlety gives way to confrontation, Batman's resolve hardens. Forsaking firearms for the refined might of cybernetic enhancements, he chooses to subdue rather than destroy. The guerrilla arms, now conduits of controlled fury, unleash electric shocks and black wall energy with a balletic precision, each strike a balance between force and mercy. True strength lies in restraint, 
he reminds himself, as adversaries falter before him, overwhelmed yet unharmed. Time itself seems to yield, slowed by the Kerenzikov cyberware that syncs with Batman's combat rhythm. His movements become a dance, adversaries rendered statuesque against his swift strikes. Every second counts, he notes, the flow of battle bending to his tempo. Amidst this new battleground, Batman's essence evolves. The Quake ability, once a mere tool, now epitomizes his command over the battlefield, sending shockwaves through both Earth and enemy. Power, unbridled yet directed, he considers, feeling the city resonate with his every action. His journey through Night City is a testament to an unyielding discipline, a commitment to a justice as pure as it is non-lethal. The essence of the Bat endures, Batman realizes, his every decision a reflection of a deeper creed, his strength wielded with a precision that safeguards life. In Night City, Batman finds not just a new challenge, but a reaffirmation of his mission. His arsenal, each piece a careful selection, speaks of a justice that transcends the mere augmentation of power. Here, in the neon shadows, he stands as both a legacy and a herald of what's to come, his presence a signal to all. The Dark Knight watches vigilant, he affirms, the guardian of a city on the brink, embodying the hope and the defiance needed to confront the darkness. In the heart of Night City's corporatic expanse, Batman's evolution is masterfully sculpted across four critical realms. The shadowed finesse of stealth in the cool attribute, the dynamic movement and quickened pace under reflexes, the steadfast durability rooted in body, and the pioneering advancements encapsulated by technical ability. Veiled in the endless dusk, Batman refines his mastery of stealth, turning the cool attributes into a silent art form. It's here, amid the labyrinthine alleys and the pulsing neon, that his art of disappearance reaches new depths. The middle tree of his talents unfurls, nurturing a stealth that verges on the ethereal. With every crouch sprint, he moves as if part of the breeze itself, leaving no trace. His presence felt only as a fleeting chill by those who dare cross his path. This mastery over the unseen becomes his most potent weapon, allowing him to navigate the city's underbelly with an elegance that masks the strength lying dormant within. Each movement, each silent breath, is a testament to his discipline, making him an enigma, a ghost weaving through the very fabric of crime and corruption. On the right side of the cool tree, his batarangs evolve, now imbued with the city's cutting-edge technology. These neon-lit discs cut through the darkness not with the sound of slicing air, but with the quietude of falling shadows. Launched with precision, they serve as silent judges, their verdicts swift and unseen, always returning to Batman, ready to be unleashed again. In this dance of shadows and light, Batman reasserts his dominion, an eternal loop of justice in the palm of his hand. As Batman merges once again with the shadows, his mastery of cool transforming him into an unseen specter, his journey takes him deeper into the visceral heart of this urban expanse. Here, within the body tree's embrace, the crucible of combat awaits, a trial by fire that promises to temper his resolve with the unyielding force of the urban fray. In the quiet that precedes the storm, Batman stands resolute, his resolve a beacon. The middle branch of the body attributes sprawls before him, each enhancement a testament to his evolution. Health regeneration accelerates, a reflection of both his peak physical condition and the cybernetic enhancements woven into his very sinew by the city's shadowed innovators. Adrenaline becomes more than a mere biological response, it's a tangible shield, a burst of vitality that cloaks him in those moments when the balance teeters on the brink, a divine halo for a guardian cloaked in humanity. Venturing further, the right branch unfolds, transforming the martial prowess honed in Gotham's darkness into a symphony of destruction. His hands, augmented by the technological marvel of guerrilla arms, transcend their mortal beginnings. Each punch, each deflection, is an ode to the kinetic ballet of combat, where control and power converge in a display of devastating elegance. The very air seems to recoil with each connection, his adversaries caught in the tempest of his making. Amidst this dance of might and motion, the quake ability emerges as a chorus of fury, 
a skill once reserved now unleashed with abandon. The earth itself heeds his command, trembling beneath the force of his presence. This newfound dominion over the ground beneath him, a raw display of power, marks every footfall with the promise of upheaval. Ascending to the city's rooftops, grappling Hook at the ready, Batman transforms descent into devastation. His arrival from on high is not merely an attack but a declaration, a gravitational edict that spells ruin for those caught in its wake. Here in the plummet and the impact, Batman reclaims the night, his every action a stark reminder of the power vested in the mantle he bears. Emerging from the steadfast resilience cultivated within his body's fortifications, Batman ventures into the intricate lattice of reflexes. Here, in the ballet of battle, his agility and precision crystallize into a spectacle of martial grace. His reflexes, sharpened beyond the ken of mere mortals, flirt with the edges of the supernatural, casting his every movement in the light of preternatural foresight. In the weave of this skill tree, Batman's essence of swift justice comes alive. His agility transforms him into a wraith, his dashes as sudden as the retreat of shadow under the glare of light, his every move a testament to the seamless fusion of grace and power. The air dash becomes his signature, the city's sprawling expanse now a canvas for his aerial artistry. Stamina, the usual shackle of human exertion, bends under his will. Where others see the cost of action, Batman finds renewal, his vigor undiminished by the exertion of his dynamic maneuvers. Each leap, each burst of speed, fuels him further, an endless cycle of energy that defies the physics of flesh and bone. Yet, it's in the whisper-thin margin between contact and evasion that Batman's training in reflexes truly shines. He becomes the master of avoidance, his presence in combat as elusive as a specter, leaving adversaries grasping at illusions. This dance of evasion is his armor, rendering him untouchable, a phantom even amidst the phrase chaos. In the glow of ever-present neon, a profound transformation finds its pinnacle. Here, within the intricate web of technical ability, Batman finds the crescendo of his journey, a fusion of flesh and circuitry, where his essence intertwines with the digital heartbeats of the city. It's a realm where his physical prowess meets the pinnacle of technological mastery, turning him into a maestro of a cybernetic symphony. Every movement, every decision, a note played in perfect harmony with the urban sprawl's electronic soul. In this dance with technology, Batman doesn't just use the tools at his disposal, he merges with them. The technical tree under his scrutiny flourishes, cyberware enhancements becoming more than mere augmentations. They are the silent whispers of his will, extensions of his very being, allowing him to navigate the digital depths with a grace and precision that feels like second nature. Every wire, every line of code offers a new battleground for justice, he contemplates, his gaze piercing through the city's digital veil. Choosing to sidestep the seductive chaos of cyberpsychosis, Batman's mental fortress stands unassailable. In a city where excess and loss of control are the norms, his discipline emerges as a beacon of sanity, a testament to his unwavering resolve. His cybernetic choices reflect this ethos, each enhancement, each tweak, a step towards perfecting his mission without surrendering to the frenzy that technology can induce. On the technical tree's left branch, his strategic insight becomes evident, transforming consumables into pivotal elements of warfare. Smoke grenades evolve beyond simple concealment, orchestrating the rhythm of battle, while health items are refined for peak performance, anchoring him amidst the fray. Preparation and adaptability, he acknowledges silently, valuing the cunning over sheer force in a world where strength is not the sole arbiter of fate. Within the nuanced intricacies of his training, Batman discovers the relic skills, a testament to his ever-evolving battle tactics. These abilities, rooted in the deepest understanding of technology and combat, offer him unprecedented control over the battlefield. Vulnerability analytics emerges as a cornerstone of this new arsenal. With it, Batman's vision pierces beyond the mere physical, allowing him to discern the hidden weaknesses of his adversaries in the heat of conflict. Strikes become more than just blows, they're calculated decisions, each hit targeting a vulnerability to deal massive damage and swiftly incapacitate foes. This skill transforms every encounter into a strategic game, where Batman's insight grants him the upper hand. Jailbreak, 
the second of the relic skills, enhances the power coursing through his gauntlets. Now, with a mere gesture, he can unleash potent shockwaves, capable of staggering multiple enemies simultaneously. This ability not only amplifies his physical prowess, but also embodies his tactical genius, enabling him to control the flow of battle, turning overwhelming odds into opportunities for decisive victory. In the quietude of twilight, Batman's silhouette merges with the darkness, his mastery of relic skills weaving the tapestry of his evolution. These moments of solitude are where past lessons and future innovations converge, guiding him with the subtlety of a whisper through the dance of combat. With each shadow I embrace, I forge my path, he reflects, the melding of ancient wisdom with the pulse of new technology shaping his journey. As night enfolds the city, Batman stands as a testament to transformation, his legacy not merely enduring but evolving. A guardian reborn, he remains steadfast in his pursuit of justice, wielding fear and vengeance as his tools. Once the shadow that guarded Gotham, he now navigates the darkness of Night City, illuminating the lives of those concealed within its corrupt depths. In the dense veil of dusk that now serves as his dominion, Batman weaves the intricate web of cyberware into the very fibers of his being. This city, with its ceaseless pulse and shadowed corners, demands a new kind of warfare, a blend of muscle and machine that Batman embraces with a silent vow. His body becomes a living testament to resilience, each enhancement a carefully chosen ally in his silent war against the city's underbelly. Choosing the chrome compressor, he whispers to himself, mastery over oneself is the first victory. This choice isn't just tactical, it's a declaration of his indomitable will, ensuring his mind remains a sanctuary amidst the digital tempest. The streets below, alive with the neon dance of danger, watch as he moves, unseen yet omnipresent. The Kerenzikov system under his command slows the world to a breath, allowing him moments of clarity in the chaos, a ballet of precision where he is both dancer and choreographer. In the stillness between seconds I find my advantage, he reflects, each movement a ghostly echo in the night. His fists, now conduits of electrified judgment and digital disruption, strike with the weight of his convictions. Even the lethal potential of Blackwall energy is tamed under his command, a lethal force turned guardian angel. With great power comes the greater responsibility to wield it justly, he muses, the city's heartbeat sinking with his own. Through the haze of battle, his enhanced vision carves clarity from the smoke, turning concealment into an extension of his will. The chaos becomes his canvas, each enemy and obstacle highlighted against the shroud of war. In the veil of confusion, I am the unseen truth, Batman contemplates, his presence felt as a shifting shadow, always just beyond reach. And with legs engineered for endless ascent, he defies the gravity that binds others to the earth. The city's skyline becomes a playground, each leap and bound a testament to his boundless pursuit of justice. The sky is not the limit, but the beginning, he realizes, the wind his companion in the silent vigil over his newfound arena. Each piece of cyberware, each silent decision, is a thread in the greater tapestry of his mission. Batman, reborn under the watchful gaze of the city's neon eyes, remains a beacon of hope in a world teetering on the brink. His journey through the shadows is more than adaptation. It's a transcendence, a silent pledge to protect, adapt and overcome, no matter the cost. Amidst the relentless rain that drapes the city in a shimmering veil, Batman watches from his lofty perch, the city sprawling endlessly beneath him. Raindrops dance on the concrete, the rhythm of the night punctuated by the distant hum of cars navigating the slick streets. The neon lights, blurred by the downpour, cast the world below in a haze of colors, a vivid contrast to the darkness above. From this vantage point, the city feels both vast and intimate, its secrets laid bare beneath the watchful gaze of the dark night. The rain, unending and cleansing, seems to wash the grime into the gutters, yet the shadows remain deep and impenetrable. It's here, in the embrace of the storm, that Batman finds a reflection of his own journey, a path marked by tempests, both literal and metaphorical. The patter of rain against his cape, 
the whisper of wind as it races through the canyons of steel and glass becomes a companion to his solitary vigil. In this deluge, the city reveals its true face, he muses, his eyes scanning the streets below, ever vigilant. The rain, relentless as his pursuit of justice, serves as both a shroud and a lens, blurring the lines between predator and protector. As lightning cleaves the sky, illuminating the city in stark relief, Batman's silhouette is etched against the turmoil of the heavens. In this moment, he is both a part of the city, and apart from it, a solitary figure against the chaos, drawing strength from the storm that rages around him. The rain-soaked streets, alive with the pulse of the night, reflect the myriad battles fought in the shadows, each droplet a testament to the enduring struggle against corruption and despair. The city's heart beats strongest in the storm, Batman reflects, his resolve hardened by the challenges that lie ahead. With the city beneath him and the storm above, Batman stands as a beacon of hope in a world teetered on the edge of darkness. The rain, with its promise of renewal and its threat of oblivion, mirrors the eternal cycle of vigilance and valor that defines the dark night. In the heart of the tempest, Batman finds not just a battleground, but a sanctuary, a place where the legacy of the dark night continues to unfold as relentless and enduring as the rain that baptizes the city night after night. Thank you for venturing with us into the night, where we've unraveled the essence of Batman's transition into the cybernetic heart of Night City. It's been an odyssey of discovery, from the shadowed silence of perfected stealth to the vibrant glow of neon batarangs, the strategic obscurity of smoke bombs, the swift ascent via grappling hook, and the uncompromising strength of guerrilla fist combat. Should this deep dive into the Dark Knight's toolkit stir the vigilante within you, we invite you to endorse our journey with a like and subscribe. For more tales from the Urban Abyss and guides to mastering the night, connect with us through our socials. All links are waiting in the description below. Your insights and curiosity are the beacon guiding our exploration. Leave us your thoughts, suggestions for future forays, or any tactics you're keen to witness in action, right down in the comments. As we draw the curtains on this journey, let us hold fast to the creed that steers the guardian of the night. It's not who I am underneath, but what I do that defines me. This is not farewell, but a pause before we dive into the next saga. Continue to explore, stay ignited with inspiration, and let your deeds echo your true essence, following in the footsteps of Batman. Until we meet again in the shadows, may your path be guided by the light of your convictions,